Hi everybody. It's Crystal. So how's everybody doing today? So I don't, I know what, this is just a little quick video I wanted to do to show some people, you know, since right now the making of the video, 11-2-2020, it is, um, uh, fall. So now, so, uh, and winter's coming up. So, um, a lot of people like to make hats and a lot of people like to put pom-poms on them. And I get asked a lot of times, um, where I buy my pom-poms and which are the best pom-poms and how do you do a pom-pom? I'm going to show you now. So I actually did buy some and I'm going to, now this is not, um, I'm going to show, I bought all mine from Amazon. It is not an affiliated link. I do not get paid if you buy the pom-poms. I don't care if you buy them. I'm just answering people's questions that, sh that ask about sizing and, and stuff like that and how you do it. So, um, I have a few packs of pom-poms that I bought. So occasionally... Um, there's a couple different sizes that I buy. Um, my main size that I buy is four inch pom poms. So here's one sack of four inch pom poms. I will put links to each one of these below in the description box so you can check them out and see um, if you if it's something that you want. Um, but anyways, uh, they they come all squashed up in a pack. Now some of them have bands on them. Those are the ones that I prefer to buy and those are my favorite but i don't always buy these kind but anyways to deal with a pom-pom so these are for four inches you know that doesn't look like four inches really you take them and you fluff them like this and then what you're supposed to do is you take your trusty old hair dryer which i only use for pom-pom purposes and you fluff it up for a while you do that look at that voila it looks better I could do it more and the more you do it the more it'll uh, poof up so this is one variety I got so I will label this in the description box pack one okay and what it has I think it has um, it has 20 pom-poms there's two of each color in there there's like the skunk color black and white there's some rose color pink and pretty much the rest are all neutral colors but there's two of each color in there. Now the next pack I have is called, I will mark number pa two pack in the description box and I'll put the link to it. These are just called, these are 30 pieces. Now these are actually four inch pom poms too. Um, and you can see they come really squashed and these have, I think the same, yes, they have the elastic. The elastic is what I prefer because it's easy to sew onto your project. But some people don't like the elastic. But anyways, you get in and you flop them. Like that. Break out your hair dryer. Alright. And you keep doing that until they poof out to your desired likings. So they count four inches actually from the very last point to the very last point. But these are really what commonly used ones. Now this pack of 30 has tons of colors in it and it does have two of each color. You can see some rainbow ones in there, some mixed colors, blues, all different colors. Reds, I like digging that red in there, that's pretty. So I will mark that one, pack two, um, that I'm showing you in the description box in the links. Now. Um, I got some six inch pom poms. These are awesome. Now the only downfall to these for me is that they have buttons. Some people prefer buttons. I'm not the button type of person, but I will use these because they have buttons. Now they come with these, which people find these more convenient and that's fine. I do use these sometimes. This is what you would sew on the inside of the top of your hat. And then the pom poms, have the other one already attached so um, I guess you could sew it on the inside of the top of your hat as long as the I don't know actually either sew it on the top of your hat or the inside of the top of your hat so that that pokes through I don't know probably the top of your hat I don't, I don't know 
All I know is it's got a button on it and somehow you sew it on. Anyways, I thought these were so pretty. Now these are six inch pom poms. Fluff them up. Ugh. These are pretty. Give them a fluff. these before the I mean I've had six inch ones but these are new to me this was a new uh, a listing that I'm last year they didn't have these that I've seen anyways those are pretty look at the colors in that one. Oh, I gotta make a hat to match that anyways and they come in these are a little smash you'd have to fluff them up but these come in six to a pack and they're all similar in color as far as they have um, three of the uh, orangey ones. No, I guess not. No, two of these orangey ones that kind of match, I guess. No, they're all different. <laughs> they're, all, they're all different colors. See, if you could picture them fluffed, but they're really pretty. I like those. I'm going to fluff one of these green ones real quick. Or green and pink ones. Is that the one I just did? Maybe that's the one I just did. Let me fluff this purple one. You guys can turn me off if you want. I'm just fluffing up palms. I'm telling you how to use them here. Anyways, the more you fluff it with your hair dryer, the more it'll come out. I like those big six, six inch palms. Those are really pretty colors. I mean, that is gorgeous. Those are my fall. so fall. Look how big that thing is. I know. Let me measure it. I know they measure from the very tip of each side, but we'll see if it's six inches. Yeah, it is if you count the very farthest hair on this side and the very farthest hair on this side. I like that one. So I'll mark this one as pack um, three in the description box and I'll put a link to that. I like those six inch palms a lot. I might be using those. They come in a pack like this and they have three different varieties. Well, two in one listing. Here was the other one. I won't fluff it with the hair dryer because the hair dryer is probably pretty annoying, but again, they're six inches. Once you fluff them, they'll get big like the others. I have to do a fluff. I'm sorry. I got to see what it looks like fluff. <laughs> That's the only time I use a hair dryer. I keep it in here to fluff palms. Pretty. It's pretty. So they have that one. So I'll mark that one. Pack uh, four. And there's six of them in there. And then they had one more pack of six inch palms that I thought were really, really pretty. They have two of each color. These, these also, these, all these six inch palms have the buttons. They also have instructions. No, they don't. Yeah, they do. Um, no, they don't. Anyways, anyways, you just sew this on somehow. Um, I guess whenever I do it, I'll show you how to do it. But, and then they have, it attaches the buttons onto this. These are really pretty. These colors of these palms.
Okay. All right, no more hair dryer. That's good. All right. So this is what they look like. You get two of each of these colors in this pack. Look how big those are. Those are awesome. They got like the raccoon uh, style. Uh, they're not real. None of these are real. They're faux fur. But uh, they're neat. When you fluff them out, look how cool and big they get. You could fluff them out more and make them more round. But I just, I'm kind of, I was just kind of briefly showing you what they look like fluffed out. Wow, I measured these. These look bigger than the other ones. These are like seven inches if you measure like from tip to hair to tip to hair. These are by far my favorite ones, I think. Maybe because of that because of the size. Look at the size of my head. Wow, you'd have to make a that'd be good for a slouchy hat. But you know what? I do like all the palms I got. Those are really pretty. Um, I like the um, uh, the rat, the black tips on them. I think they call that like raccoon style or something. I'm not sure. But I like the black tips on them and I like how large they are. They're really pretty poofed out. But these are gorgeous poofed out too. They're pretty big. The collars on these are remarkable. Very beautiful. Yeah. And the other ones are the four inch. So I'll mark these ones. These ones that I, when I fluked them out, they measured like almost seven inches across. Um, I'll mark them pack uh, five of what I've shown. So on in the, in the description box. So just a short video. Uh, remember Amazon, links below to all these. I will label them from the order that I showed you. And I showed you the different how some of them have a band and some of them have the buttons. I prefer the band, but I can use the buttons, especially when they're really gorgeous palms. Those are really pretty and really big and super cool. Of course, I'm going to use them on a Saatchi or something this winter. They're good to put on um, scarves too, at the bottom of scarves. Um, those pink little four inch palms that are pink, I'll probably use for Evelyn stuff. Good to put on the corners of palm or if you got like a four corner poncho you can use palms for those uh anything really that your mind can think of they're good for bags to hang off bags palms have many uses other than just hats you just got to think about it but oh pretty i'm happy this green one's really pretty too they're all pretty i love them all but remember they will look really smashed and they'll take more blow drying than what i did i just did a quick click quick blow dry on them that one looks spray painted almost, don't it? I think it was called watercolors. Okay, all gonna go now. Remember, the link to these below, not affiliated. I don't care if you buy them. People just ask me where I get my palms and how you make them look like round and um, how you attach them and, and, and stuff like that. So I thought I'd just show you because I bought a bunch of palms for, and they all came today for winter. So um, to put on scarves and hats and ponchos and all my winter items, so. There you go. You guys can check out those links. And that's where Bagodet gets her palms. Amazon. Bye, everybody. Have a good day. Stay safe.